Hi everyone, thank you for tuning in to Nikki's Notes. We are talking to the man of the hour, at least for a little while longer, the AFP board chair, Bob Carter. Thanks for joining us, Bob. Thank you, thanks for having me. Well, you are about to be closing out your term as board chair, but looking back over the last couple of years, what are you most proud of? Um, it's, it's difficult to put my finger right on one particular topic, but I will say that I'm most proud of the organization and getting to know it, getting to know it better, the staff, the board that I work with, the amazing volunteers that are part of this organization, and of course the opportunity to work with so many uh, other organizations like ours throughout the world and to be a part of that community. Um, I think using the position of chair as a platform to make a difference in the world and to in fact, bring AFP to a stronger position at the highest levels of business and government has been something I've really enjoyed. Very nice. Well, we've enjoyed having you, of course, and you are moving on as chair, but you're not getting rid of us that easily. <laughs> What's next for well, you're AFP? getting rid of me that No, easily. never, never. <laughs> What's next for AFP? What are you kind of leaving in your legacy for them to carry on next year? Well, I think the uh, that area that I mentioned uh, frequently if you ever talk to me about anything that public policy has yes. a tendency to come up and I think that's the area that uh, because of the timing in the country in the USA and in Canada and other parts of the world now public policy is very much on the front burner yeah. I think that the fact that over the last two years we've really taken a strong position at the table mm -hmm. in many parts of the world related to that related to tax deductibility and uh, other areas of public policy. I think that's probably where AFP is going to continue to need to be strong and go. Yeah, absolutely. And we will stay tuned to see what happens with all of that. Now, we've had a lot of fun having you. There have been many a karaoke nights and speeches <laughs> with cowboy hats, so we hope you have had as much fun as we have. Why would you tell others to strive for this position, to serve on a committee, on a board, and ultimately as board chair? Well, I think uh, getting beyond the karaoke, uh, there are some, some real uh, outstanding benefits for the individual, uh, but also for the organization. You know, the lifeblood of an organization like this is the people who comprise it. Yeah. And uh, individuals in this profession would find that there's no other platform like this, being a part of the largest uh, collaboration, if you will, of fundraisers and people involved in philanthropy in the world. Yeah and having the opportunity to impact not only in your own area, in your own backyard, but impact the future all around the world by being a volunteer at a top level at AFP is quite an honor. Yeah, well, it's been an honor for us as well. We are certainly going to miss you, but once an AFP chair, always an AFP family. So we'll always have you. Thank you so much for chatting with us and for everything that you've done. Thank you. I appreciate it. And thank you all so much for following along the last couple of years. We hope you stay tuned for the future. Thanks so much.